The drug trade is estimated to be worth $500 billion worldwide and has now made its way to Nigeria, destroying lives and becoming a huge challenge for the government to combat. Around 1981, 1983, there were only two joints on the whole of Lagos. But now, you have drug joints everywhere. Everywhere. I mean everywhere. In the joint, there are army people, police, officers. Go to a joint, a bunk. Just like a whole place like this. Just like can get drugs everywhere. It's hundred now. It turns a man upside down. It makes him less than a human being. Okay, I'm 800 years old. He is 34 years old, precisely. He can stay like that for the next three days. I found myself in a pit, so to speak, where all that was visible was darkness. I was going to Asia, or get it from Asia, do some runs, drop it somewhere, like a relay team. Because at the point in time it was fun, later it wasn't fun. I was irrelevant and necessary security agencies have been compromised. This is Charlie. This word, 500 naira. I've used the wine, I've used cocaine, I've used my wine. The most brutal of those three is my wine. And we all know that it's a highway, not just a gateway to other drugs. Even my enemy, I don't pray for my enemy. So it all begins with an experiment. This search for the ultimate high. You never get the ultimate high. It's just like a mirage. When you think I'm putting to it, you see something.